Okay, so this is how to do, or how to make your player move and attack from the game maker. Uh, so yeah. Uh, for this one, I'm gonna be using this sprite. Each you go. So first, you wanna load a stance up. Um, stance. You have to put the underscore because the the codes that you're gonna use. You need to put the underscore or else the code will not work. So you want to load his stance. Next, you want to load him running. Run. Okay. For him to run in the other direction, for beginners, all you got to do is you edit, conform, flip. It will say apply to all. Okay. And then go. Run. Right. Or left. Left. Like that. And then I'm only going to load one attack just for the sake of time. Uh, actually, I'm going to load this one. Ichigo. Also, you're going to have to load a, you don't really have to load a sprite, all you got to do is create it. It's just a basic wall, so he doesn't fall or go instantly in space or whatever. And then whatever, I'm just going to fall. Okay, so what you want to do is first, all you got to do is make an object, just make the wall an object, make it a solid. You can choose if you want to make it visible, like if you have a background. You can just put it under the terrain and make it invisible, which is shaking it again. But this one, I don't really want to take it too much time, so I'm just going to make it visible. Uh, well, you're done with that now. And next, you want to make your person in a stance. You can name him whatever you want on the object, but his stance is, you just want to make him an object. Of course, visible, solid. Okay. So, this is for when do not press any key at all. So when you do move, as soon as you let it go, it will stop and start keep on going. Okay. And this is for attacks. Uh, index. This is going to be the code that you're going to be using the whole video. So, uh, go stamp. Because this is for when you press attack. If you don't have this, he will keep attacking instantly and he will never stop. Next will just be the basic running. Uh, left. Left. You can set it at whatever speed. Don't even worry about the relative button. I'll just put it to 4 because that's what I mainly use when I try to make games. Make straight index equals. This is what you name him running left. So when you do press the left button, he will be facing left and running. So basically, you do the same. Right. Except in the right direction. Or left. Grab. Undo that. Let's run that. Uh, control. I want to enter the same code. Run. Not. But. Um. Okay. So this is the attack. Basically, you can set it to any key you want. I usually set it, set my attacks to you know ASD and Z and stuff like that. You want to put the code right index equals and whatever you named your guy attacking so mine is ichigo underscore attack underscore one you have to have the underscores that's the whole reason because it will not work unless you have the underscores for the code so that's basically it the code that you use you just use, you already use for the rest of them so you can get familiar with that
Now you have to make a room. This is the like must in game makers. You cannot play a game without it having a room. So that's the whole point of the wall. That's gonna be my room. I don't know. So usually you put it around and make a collision. That's for another video. But now I'm just gonna put here. Okay. Now you wanna put your player in that room. Where you put the box, there you place it wherever. Okay. Okay. Now I'm just gonna show you how it works. So as you can see, run. Ah, uh, I said Ah man. I uh, left I said the wrong direction. Uh, my bad. Okay, so, see, now he's in the Okay. A, chat. going down a little bit. If you have a problem with that, message me or contact me or whatever. Leave a comment. I will see if I can help you as much as I can. And basically, all you really have to do is give a couple of that. Yeah. So, just. He has this and that. Uh, so this is. I made this channel just so you could basically learn to be gamer. It was really hard for me starting off. I didn't know nothing about game making. So this is just basic tutorials for like basic games. Like, Mugen's are my favorite. That's the whole reason I got game makers because I watch them make Mugen's. At least try to. I'm not great at it, but I know how to do stuff. So yeah, this is for beginners mostly or people who just don't know how to do certain things. Uh, whatever you want me to do, just message me. So whatever you want me to show you, just message me. I'll make a video on it, or you can just leave it in the comments. The most likes, I will uh, probably do a video on next, or just pick it up randomly, because probably not many people are going to watch my videos anyway. But yeah, so uh, that, is, that is basically it. Thanks for watching. Please, please subscribe. I want to get... I want to try to get the website going up so I can load my sprites on and, you know, so you can copy my sprites or whatever you need to do, like, you can load some of my games up, try to change it, make a Phoenix of it, send it to me. I'll probably show it and see how good you did. I'll just send you the link or whatever. But that is when I, if I even get a website going up, I really want to, just to help people, so, uh, yep, that is, that is it, um, uh, so, uh,